Okay. Just. Whoa. Okay. Just making sure everything all is working correctly. Ugh. Oh. Bitrate is like garbage. It's like 4,000. What is happening? Who knows? Who cares? I'll stream anyways. Today is going to be a. Uh, is my sound coming through? Doesn't look like it is. Okay, take it back, it is. Okay, um... So. Everything's fine. Everything's working. <laughs> okay, so today is going to be like a, uh... What's the word I want to use? Plot-heavy day? I guess all of them are plot-heavy days. But, uh... Where the fuck do I go from here? <laughs> Where do I go from here? But, like last episode, we escaped from Midgar, which is very action-packed. Lots of boss fights and fighting. It was all great and stuff, which is fine. Did I, like, <laughs> put anybody? <laughs> didn't put shit on anybody. Great. And Anaki out there just, like, fucking <laughs> equipped with nothing. Great. Um, so, yeah, last episode, we escaped from Midgar. Lots of boss fights, lots of action-packed shit happened. I should, like, equip things on people before I continue walking. Or I'm gonna get myself killed. Drift turn? Whatever. Whatever. Die. Oh my god. Give me your items! Whatever, you're dead. <gasps> Zeta! Hello! How are you? I should put things on. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Fire. All. Oh. Is that is that it? Sense way down here. Okay. Sure. <laughs> sure. It's fine. I am doing great, actually. Uh, oops. Got out of work like three hours ago. Husband's out at a at a play committee meeting, so I am at home streaming. Um, mm, give you that. And give you that. And give you... Oh. That. That seems fine. Who knows? Who knows? Not I. I think this is where I'm supposed to go, right? Nope. Yep, we made it. This must be calm. Everyone's waiting at the end. Let's go, Cloud. Let's go, Cloud. Right. Well, let's go. Whatever. Don't need to actually sleep. Just go up and talk. Cloud, you're late. Yo, man, you're late. Sorry to keep you waiting. Guess everyone's here now. So, let's hear your story. You know, the one about Sephiroth and the crisis of the planet. Let's hear it all. I used to want to be like Sephiroth, so I joined Soldier. After working with Sephiroth on several missions, we became friends. You call that a friend? Yeah, well, he was older than me and hardly ever talked about himself. So, I guess you'd call us war buddies? We trusted each other. Until one day. One day? After the war, it was soldiers' duty to put down any resistance against the Shinra. That was five years ago. I was sixteen. You know, it never occurred to me before, but... Cloud's a child soldier! That, like, 
That never occurred to me right before now. I've beaten this game multiple times. Wow. Dude, that's fucked up. It sure is raining hard. Hey, how are you doing? I'm alright. I wouldn't know. I've never had motion sickness. Everything okay? Hey. Settle down. They gave me some new materia. I can't wait to use it. Just like a kid. You gonna brief us about this mission? This isn't a typical mission. Good. Why do you say that? I joined a soldier to be like you, but by the time I made first class, the war was already over. My big hopes of becoming a hero like you ended with the war. That's why I always sign up whenever there's a big mission, kind of a way to prove myself. Say, how do you feel, Mr. Sephiroth? I thought you wanted a briefing. Our mission is to investigate an old Mako reactor. There have been reports of it malfunctioning and producing brutal creatures. First, we will dispose of these creatures. Then, we will locate the problem and neutralize it. Brutal creatures? Where? The Mako reactor at Nibelheim. Nibelheim. That's where I'm from. Hmm. Hometown. S sir Something strange just crashed into the truck. That would be our monster. I can just, like, do nothing. Doesn't even hurt Sephiroth. Just kills a dragon on his own. It's, like, the only time you will see his victory... Victory fanfare pose. I think you might also be able to see it if you get into a fight climbing up Mount Nibble, but that's like that's it. It's like uh, he is just that good. It's like Seymour in Ten, where there's like that one battle he's in the party with you, and like you can use it to see his overdrive and like his victory animation, and that's it. It's last time. Anyways, Sephiroth's strength is incredible. He is far stronger in reality than any stories you may have heard about him. So, where do you come in? Me? I was mesmerized by the way Sephiroth fought. And then we reached Nibelheim. How does it feel? It's your first time back to your hometown in a long time, right? How does it feel? I wouldn't know, because I don't have a hometown. Um, how about your parents? My mother is Genova. She died right after she gave birth to me. My father... What does it matter? I know that feel. Don't feel bad about it. Alright, let's go. I imagine I'll just be reading conversations for lots and lots of text coming up for this super long interactive cutscene. Being on watch is so boring. Just sit tight. It's your job, right? I'll come and talk to you once in a while. Just stick with it. S you keep wanting around here and you'll get in trouble. The Mako smells pretty bad here. Yo, wait a minute. Isn't that, uh... The name of Sephiroth's mother? I remember Genova. That's the damn headless spook living in the Shinra building. That's right. Barrett, would you please let us hear what Cloud has to say? You can ask questions later. Tifa, I was only... Okay, Cloud, continue. The childhood friends reunite! I was really surprised with Tifa. The town was quiet. 
Everyone must be in their house, afraid to come out because of the monsters. No. Maybe they're afraid of us. We leave for the reactor at dawn. Make sure you get to sleep early. All we need is one lookout, so you others, get some rest. Oh, and... You may visit your family and friends. Man, I'm so nervous. How come? Look, you never know when a monster is going to show up, right? I heard Sephiroth was coming, so I brought my camera. I want a shot of Sephiroth and a monster. Take my picture. You don't take pictures of nobodies. Cold, dude. Welcome. Hey, aren't you... Have you been here before? I don't remember. Now you're pissing me off. This don't matter, so get on with it. Oh, so, the anecdote about the guy with the camera, that mattered, but, like, clouds trip into the bar? Nope, unimportant. Irrelevant fluff. <laughs> Move on! Oh, this is Cloud's home, isn't it? This is my house. It has nothing to do with what happened five years ago. Yo, wait, I want to hear. Really, Barrett? <laughs> me too, it's been a long time, right? Tell us more. I don't want to know about your trip to the bar, but tell me all about your mom. <laughs> All right. I don't know if you'd call it a family. My father died when I was still young. That's why my mom lived alone in this house. Yeah, I saw my mom. My mom, she was a vibrant woman. Hadn't changed at all, but a few days later, she died. But when I saw her, she looked fine. Claude, that's a really vague way to say that when you're going to reveal to them in, like, 30 minutes that Sephiroth burned down the whole town, which is why she died. Like, she seemed fine when I saw her. But of course, she caught fire later and died. <laughs> she seemed fine, though. Uh. Yes? Cloud? Welcome home, Cloud! Hi, Mom. Come, come. Let me take a look at you. Hmm. You look so handsome. So, is this a soldier uniform? Mom, I... My, how you've grown. I'll bet the girls never leave you alone. Not really. I'm worried about you. There are a lot of temptations in the city. I'd feel a lot better if you just settled down with a nice girlfriend. I'm alright. You should have an older girlfriend, one that'll take care of you. I think that would be best for you. I'm not interested. Are you eating right? I'm alright. The company takes care of me. Is that so? I know you can't cook. I've been worried sick about you. Cloud? You know Cloud. Isn't that right, Cloud? I'll always be your mother. Let's stop this. Cloud? Did you go in my house? Yes. I thought you might be home. Of course there's nothing here. Oh, my God. These controls are garbage! Cloud, did you go in my room? I did indeed. <laughs> Played with your piano! Um, yeah, well, nothing there. I'm not doing the thing where you pull out Tifa's underwear. That would be incredibly pervy and gross. <laughs> I'm not gonna do it. Gonna hard pass on that one. Also makes Tifa like you a lot less. Oh, you're with the Shinra? The Shinra. You're with the Shinra? Welcome. Oh, I'm sorry. It's you, Cloud. I didn't recognize you. 
Shinra? Shinra? Soldier? Salsa? Are you going to kill the monsters? Are you going to? Do your best. Do your best. No, there's nothing here. Okay. I think that's enough dilly-dallying, so... Let's get on with the plot. Oh! What's your nuts? Oh, it's, it's like Gan... Gangriff or something? Is Shunra here to get rid of the monsters? And who are you? Zengen. Zengen! That's it! I'm Zengen. I travel around the world teaching children martial arts. I have 128 students all over the world. In this town, a girl named Tifa is my student. Did you say Tifa? Tifa has a good sense. She'll be a powerful fighter. Great. Good to know. What are you looking at? This scenery. I feel like I know this place. We're short one bed. I mean, you're not really. There's four of you, there's three beds. Cloud can sleep at his mother's. Just say it. You don't gotta. We have an early start tomorrow, and you should get some sleep soon. Yeah, let's get some sleep. I've hired a guide to the Mako reactor. I've heard she's young. I uh, hope we can rely on her. Think they'd let me take a picture? Tifa's father. If I knew this was going to happen, I would have made mountain climbing off-limits. It is off-limits. Late again. I'm so nervous I couldn't get any sleep. Once the guide gets here, we're heading out. Listen to me, Sephiroth. In case something happens, trust me. I'll be alright, Dad. I have two men from Soldier with me. I'm Tifa. Nice to meet you. Tifa? You're the guide? That's right. It so happens I'm the number one guide in this town. It's too dangerous. I can't get you involved in this. There's no problem if you protect her. Let's go. Um. Mr. Sephiroth, please, let me take a picture. One picture for a memento. Tifa, can you ask him for me, too? Cheese! Great, thank you. I'll give each of you a copy once I get it developed. A Mako reactor was uh, built in Mount Nibble. Malach. Built in Mount Nibble. The cold mountain air of Mount Nibble was the same. I don't know who fucking decided this was the best place to put a Mako reactor and the path to get to it. But they dumb. Why are we taking a helicopter to get there? We have them. They exist. Oh, we're just going to take rickety bridge over, like, spike-laden valleys. That seems much better. It gets harder from here. Follow me. It's hurry. I will let you take care of those, Sephiroth. <laughs> All at the same time. Great. Thanks. I'll just stand here. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> I'm so useful. Ah, uh, the bridge. Ooh, those graphics. And we all fall to our death. Game over. This is how Cloud died. The, rest, the previous part of the game has been a, a fevered drug dream. He lies dying.
Everyone seems to be alright. Will we be able to get back? These caves are intertwined, like an ant farm. Oh, and Sephiroth, one person seems to be missing. It may sound cruel, but we've no time to search for him. We can't go back, so we must go on. We'll travel together from here. I think... Yeah, now you get the chance to actually, like, look at Sephiroth's shit. What's it got? Revive, in case you die. Restore. Earth. All. He's mastered all his materia. Lightning and ice. Great. And what is this equipment? The Masamune. A gold armlet. Oh, he doesn't say it. So, in the PlayStation version of the game, when you try to take off his equipment, you get, like, this little, like, pop-up that's just like, I would rather not. But him telling you, stop. <laughs> you don't get that. It's sad. Show me a stat, Sephiroth. Holy shit, your attack is maxed. <laughs> 255. We could level him up. He only needs 59,562 hundred experience to reach the next level. That should take no time at all! <laughs> What's this? A mysteriously colored cave. Wow, real helpful, Tifa. It must be the Mako energy. This mountain is especially abundant in it. That's why the Mako reactor was built here. I helped! 17 damage! Compared to, Clou uh, to Sephiroth's like 8,000 damage. <laughs> I'm good at this game. I just want to get back up there. There are no items I can pick up or anything, so... Let's just get through this. And what's this? A Mako fountain. It's a miracle of nature. It's so beautiful. If the Mako reactor continues to suck up the energy, this fountain will dry up too. Materia. When you condense Mako energy, Materia is produced. It's very rare to see Materia in its natural state. By the way, why is it that when you use Materia, you can also use magic, too? You were in Soldier, and didn't even know that? The knowledge and wisdom of the Ancients is held in the Materia. Anyone with this knowledge can freely use the powers of the land and the planet. That knowledge interacts between ourselves and the planet, calling up magic. Or, so they say. Magic. Mysterious power. <laughs> Did I say something funny? A man once told me to never use unscientific terms like mysterious power. It shouldn't even be called magic. I still remember how angry he was. Who was that? Hojo of Shinra Incorporated. An inexperienced man assigned to take over the work of a great scientist. He was a walking mass of complexes. A Mako Fountain, so this is where the knowledge of the Ancients is. We finally made it. You sure took the, the long way, though. Tifa, you wait here. I'm going inside, too. I want to see. Only authorized people are allowed in. This place is full of Shinra's industrial secrets. But, take care of the lady. Hmm. 
Oh, man. Better take real good care of me, then. Also, I want to know why the entrance to this place is, like, two wires strung up leading to, like, some chains you have to crawl down? Like, how is that an efficient way to get into this building? Who designed this place? MC Escher? Genova? This is Genova, right? It won't open. I'm also going to be straight with you right here. They had to have intentionally sent Sephiroth on this mission. And Sephiroth believes his mother is Genova. What did they think was going to happen when they sent him to the location Genova was being held? What do they think was going to happen? <sighs> Anyways. This is the reason for the malfunction. This part is broken. Cloud, close the valve. Why did it break? Now I see, Hojo. But doing this will never put you on the same level as Professor Gast. This is a system that condenses and freezes the Mako energy. That is, when it's working correctly. Now, what does Mako energy become when it's further condensed? Um, oh yeah, it becomes materia. Right. Normally. But Hojo put something else in there. Take a look. Can, can I interact with this, please? 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 What is that? Normal member... Ah, ah, normal... Ah, I can't speak. Normal members of Soldier are humans that have been showered with Mako. You're different from the others, but still human. But what are they? They've been exposed to a far higher degree of Mako than you. Is this some kind of monster? Exactly. And it's Hojo of Shinra that produced these monsters. Mutated living organisms produced by Mako energy. That's what these monsters really are. Normal members of soldiers? You mean you're different? Hey, Sephiroth! No. Was I? Was I created this way too? Sephiroth, am I the same as all these monsters? You saw it. All of them were humans. Human? No way! Ever since I was small, I felt that I was different from the others. Special in some way, but not like this. Am I... human? I didn't really understand what Sephiroth meant then. I was even more surprised that Shinra was producing monsters. I often join imperialist war machines without doing any digging whatsoever into the background. Damn, Shinra! The more I hear, the more I hate him! Who never thought the Mako Reactor held such a secret? That would seem to explain the increase in the number of monsters recently. I think we should listen carefully to Cloud. Don't you think so, Barrett? Why are you talking to me? Keep talking. <laughs> Poking his damn nose in where it don't belong? Cloud, why don't you finish that story? Phew. T 
Tifa, were you waiting outside then? Yes. You returned to Nibelheim. Sephiroth confined himself to the inn. He didn't even try to talk to me. Then, all of a sudden, he just disappeared, right? We found him inside the biggest building in Nibelheim. The villagers used to call it the Shinra Mansion. Long ago, people from Shinra used to live in that mansion. Get a nice taste of this mansion before you come here yourself. Oh, can you get to Vincent here? I think you can. They're like, Cobb just like, kind of like brushes it off. He's like, ah, this isn't important. Oh. Right. Mm, right. <laughs> Don't know what to do with that. Where's the secret way downstairs? Ah, uh, I don't remember. It's been so long since I've played. Nope, that's not it. Right, okay. Let's go upstairs then. Hello! Oh, the, the safe. Can't interact with it. Damn it. Some plants! Hello, there you are. There's no sign of Sephiroth, but I know I saw him go into this room. Wow, you dumb. Let me in. Oh, fine, whatever. Hello, Sephiroth. An apparently dead organism was found in a 2,000-year-old geological stratum. Professor Gast named the organism Genova. Mm, sometime. Genova confirmed to be an ancient. Genova Project approved. The use of Mako Reactor 1 approved for use. My mother's name is Genova. Genova Project. Is this just a coincidence? Professor Gast! Why didn't you tell me anything? Why did you die? Let me be alone. Sephiroth didn't come out of the Shinra Mansion. He continued to read as if he were possessed by something, and not once did the light in the basement go out.
ominous music. Sephiroth seems different. Traitor. Traitor? You ignorant traitor. I'll tell you. This planet origi originally belonged to the Citra. Citra was an itinerant race. They would migrate in, settle the planet, then move on. At the end of their hard, long journey, it was said they would find the promised land and supreme happiness. But those who disliked journeying appeared... They stopped their migrations, built shelters, and elected to lead an easier life. They took that which the Citra and the planet had made without giving back one whit in return. Those are your ancestors. Sephiroth. Long ago, disaster struck the planet. Your ancestors escaped. They survived because they hid. The planet was saved by sacrificing the Citra. After that, your ancestors continued to multiply. Now, all that's left of the Citra is in these reports. What does that have to do with you? Don't you see? An ancient named Genova was found in a 2,000-year-old geological stratum. The Genova Project. The Genova Project wanted to produce people with the power of the ancients, or the Citra. I am what was produced. P produced? Yes. Professor Gast, leader of the Genova Project, and genius scientist, produced me. How... how did he? S Sephiroth? Out of my way. I'm going to see my mother. Not to spoil too much, but all of this is Hojo's fault. Like, literally all of this. Every. Last. Bit. <gasps> Your town's on fire, Cloud! Not that noise! Hey, it's you. You're still sane, right? Then come over here and help me. I'll check this house. You check that one over there. Sephiroth. Terrible. Sephiroth, this is too terrible. I don't think I put enough emphasis in that word. He's just fucking killing people. And very suddenly, the ominous music just stops. I really wish I could do Sephiroth's actual voice, but I am not Lance Bass. Papa! Sephiroth! 
Did Sephiroth do this to you? Sephiroth, soldier, Mako reactor, Shinra! I hate them all! Mother, I'm here to see you. Please, open the door. How could you do that to Papa and all the townspeople? Tifa! You promised. You promised that you'd come when I was in trouble. Mother, let's take the planet back together. I've thought of a great idea. Let's go to the promised land. Sephiroth! My family! My hometown! How could you do this to them?! <laughs> They've come again, Mother. With her superior power, knowledge, and magic, Mother was destined to become the ruler of this planet. But they... Those worthless creatures... are stealing the planet from Mother. But now I'm here with you. So don't worry. What about my sadness? My family? Friends? The sadness of having my hometown taken away from me? It's the same as your sadness! <laughs> my sadness? What do I have to be sad about? I am the chosen one. I have been chosen to be the leader of this planet. I have orders to take the planet back from you stupid... Stupid people for the Citra. What should I be sad about? Sephiroth, I trusted you. No. You're not the Sephiroth I used to know. And that's the end of my story. Wait a damn minute. That's it? No more? I don't remember. What happened to Sephiroth? In terms of skill, I couldn't have killed him. Official records state Sephiroth is dead. I read it in the newspaper. Shinra Incorporated owns the newspaper, so you can't rely on that. I want to know the truth. I want to know what happened. I challenged Sephiroth and lived. Why didn't he kill me? I'm alive too. A lot of this doesn't make sense. What about Genova? It was in the Shinra building, right? Shinra shipped from Nibelheim to Midgar. Did someone carry it out later? It was missing from the Shinra building. Sephiroth? Damn! None of this makes sense! I'm going, going, going gone! And I'm leaving the thinking to you! Yo, Cloud, let's get a move on! Well, wait. Dude, we were talking here. Cloud, what's wrong? You're just gonna stand there while Sephiroth heads for the Promised Land? I ain't letting Sephiroth 
or Shinra get to no promised land. If they do, then we're all screwed. You know what I'm saying? It's beautiful. It's just beautiful, Barrett. Just leave it to me. Oh, brother. Cloud, how bad was I after Sephiroth stabbed me? I th thought you were a goner. I was so sad. I... The Ancients, Citra, Genova, Sephiroth, and myself. Let's go. Barrett's waiting. What a fascinating story. Come on, Nanaki. It's so nice of the innkeeper to let us use his room. For free. Yo, Cloud, here! Received a PHS. I don't know what PHS stands for. With PHS, I can see you any time. Alright then, we're out of here. It's a phone, basically. He gave him a cell phone. Woo! Give me that water. Um, Listen to me. Just now, some guy in a black cloak walked east towards that grassy field. He's got this killer sword. Looks real scary. Taurus, huh? Here are a few things you should know that will come in handy when you travel around the world. Well, I already know. Is that so? Well, that's that. Have a nice trip. This is my party. Still the same people. Okay. Let's uh, upgrade our equipment. As best we can, I suppose. Hey! Thanks to Mako Energy, life's pretty darn convenient thanks to Shinra. Don't you think so? You're full of it. Hmm. But I hate to think of what life would be like without Mako Energy. You'd have to use dirty energy like coal and water. <laughs> and sunshine. Like heathens. Mako Energy's made things a lot more convenient, but a lot of plants and animals have been disappearing at a rapid pace. I think the old life was better. Don't you think so? Yeah, I do. Yeah, sure, I'm right. You think so, don't you? Well, that was enlightening. Did you say you came from Midgar? I used to live there, too. But I heard they got lots of troubles lately. Okay, well. Didn't mean to do that, but I did. Okie dokie. Locked. Can't open it. Well, we'll be back here at some point. Wait, can I open this dresser? Can I even interact with it? I can! I've got an ether! Rob this old man! Rob him blind! Take all of his things. Never return. There's a dog! Doggy! That man had locked his dog in the bathroom. Hi there, random stranger. There was a suspicious looking man in a black cloak. He was carrying a mean looking sword. I will say, the thing that Sephiroth wears, that black thing, I would not describe it as a cloak. I would use coat, maybe. Or a jacket. A black trench, maybe. My older brother's so stupid, he's so embarrassing, I could just puke. When I grow up, I'm gonna be a soldier. That's why I'm training hard now. Nope, well, nothing in there. Not a thing in there. Chest! Received the Peacemaker! Isn't that a... Isn't the Peacemaker like a shotgun? Yeah! It's, it's a weapon for Vincent! We can leave the megaphone behind, but we'll take this handgun that none of us know how to use. I hear that the natural resources near the reactors are being sucked dry. We're better off with the Mako We're better off with the Mako energy. What? 
I heard President Shinra was killed, and his son Rufus, the new president, was badly hurt. Hey, I bet that's news to you. Pretty smart. Uh, just between us, I heard it was them Navo, what do you call them, that got President Shinra and his son. The famous floating city, Midgar. Just once, I'd love to see it in person. It's not like it doesn't dominate the skyline outside the city. <laughs> Is it true that Shinra makes monsters? It's true. Yeah, well, either way, as long as we use reactors, we can't stand up to Shinra. The world's at peace. All's well. Is it? Is it? I would beg to differ. My old man was a miner, but he couldn't go to work after monsters started appearing in the mithril mines. Now all he does is sit around and get drunk in the bar. Same. This is the item store. Great. Don't want any of this shit. This is the materia store. If any materials we don't have. Heal. We don't got that. Oh, Earth! And it scooted right past it. I didn't even notice it. Don't got that either. Sorry, I was sneezing there. You may have heard the start of it. This is the weapon store. So it's got a, a mithril saber, a cannonball, a mithril claw, and a full metal staff, which we can't afford, so... Gonna do some grinding. Great. And you. Oh, you already have a mythical thing. You're, uh... Resist. Oh, it makes you resistance. Huh! Put some of that stuff on, I guess. Uh... How much do I need? Just, like, 500... 800 total. That's what I need. 800 total. Right. So let's go out in the field and grind like two fights, get that staff, and then get the hell out of here. First, uh, wrong button. First, we're gonna go into the menu and then immediately leave. Here it is, level 14. Eris is level 12. Okay, well, let's replace. I know there's a way to just, like, remove all. Well, whatever. Um, let's replace Tifa oh, with Eris. Actually... Should place Eris with Barrett. Check off his materia too. Now we'll take Eris. Okay. Steel. Have sense. Isn't that a good one though? Let's replace that sense. Elemental poison. Actually, if we're just gonna be grinding, just give me the like spells, the damage spells. Give me those. Give me some of those. 
Let's run in a circle! Awkward circle! That's gonna make people dizzy. I don't really need healing wind yet. I don't think we've seen bio used yet, so... Let's use it! Woo! Okay. You just, just killed it. Hit him with that bio! Mm, yeah! Oh my god, Naki, you are terrible at, at thieving! Never mind, it's dead. So we only need around 500 gil. How much should we get? Uh, we're up to 600. So, like, one more fight. Great. Wait, I was going to. Stick one more in there. I think it should be... All. <laughs> it's not actually attached to anything, but, like, the chance to level all up is important. I would like to take advantage of it. We're just going to be doing a little bit of grinding. These motorcycles have come to murder us! Okay, let's just pop a healing win. Oh, we stole a freaking high potion. Hell yeah! Rob the other one. I don't think I'm going to manage to do it, but I would like to unlock Eris' final limit break before the. Uh, the before things that happen later happen. Not that I feel I need to have spoiler warnings for a game that is now, like, 21 years old. But just in case. <laughs> you never know who doesn't actually know. Eight hundred, bam, just like that. That's all we needed. <laughs> That's it. That was our that was our grinding for the stream. All of two battles. Move, 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 move. Please move. Oh my god. That is hell. Okay, hi there. This is the weapons store. Yes, yes. Give me the full metal staff. I oh, thank you. Pop a sense in there. I would prefer to have elemental right here and pop ice in right there. You have you already have all, don't you? Yeah. Yeah, all on the restore. Oh, you're missing a slot. Sure. Whatever. Literally don't have anything else to put here, so. Although, I do believe I'm going to switch him out, now that we're done grinding. So, actually... I need your four slot. Take this mithril armlet. Oops. Okay, and... We'll go outside, we'll PHS and pull up... I don't know. Barrett? Not had him in a bit. Yeah, Barrett, why not? Can't hurt. Yeah, he needs to actually equip his weapons. Actually. 
four slots. Yep, I know. But you're in the back, you'll be fine. All. You know what, let's make it Earth. Since. Since. Steel. Heal. Nothing. Fire. Right, okay. So we need to get that way, I think. Oh, we should we should save. Just occurred to me. So I don't have to go through that. Oh, these things have a uh, matra magic. Oh. No, don't do that. Yes. Use matra magic upon me. <gasps> Barrett has gotten his limit break. Yay. He's gonna shoot. Show me that matra magic. Mmm, yeah. Love me some blue mage powers. And Cloud is gonna throw some missiles out of his ass. Oh, Barrett's currently a melee fighter. Okay, need to move him to the front then. <laughs> we took his gun and just gave him a spiked ball. Just like, this is more effective. Use this. I don't think I'll be going back, so... Right, let's -a go! I could be heading the very wrong way. We have been surrounded by a man and his dogs. All opponents, please. Magic. Cure all of us, because that really hurt. Ooh. Grind. High potion was stolen. Ex fucking excuse you? <laughs> Give me that back! Thank you, Barrett. Received the high potion. Okay. There are bandits in these here hills. I really want to fight it. I know I can't. I really can't. I'm not the kind of gamer who has the skills necessary to kill that thing, but I really want to. This is not as fun when you come back like later in the game and kill it. Cause by then, you're just stronger than it. Okay, I don't know what's happening. Thank you! <laughs> just don't know how to react to that. But thanks. Nothing to steal. They got nothing to steal. Oh, so in this game, the moves are nice. Except when they're not. Thank you for them free heals. Oh, so it's either, like, sewer or hot spring. And sewer hurts! Unsurprisingly! Well, Barrett's done with this shit. What? Do one opponent's MP. Ooh. Learned enemy skill level 4 suicide. Yay! 
I wasn't aware that was a skill I could learn from these things. Just, just throw a cure out there, it's fine. Thank you for dying, oh my god. I take it back, the moves are still the annoying enemies I remember from the other games. She's still tiny? No, okay. Yo, I need a chocobo! Work! Work, 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 work! 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 Receive Choco Mog Materia, <gasps> our first summon spell. Gonna equip that because summon spells take forever. I have two fires, don't I? And this is the garbage one. Okay. Choco Mog. And... That one. Give me that one. I'm tempted to just go use it right now, but there's no point. It will come up, no doubt. Thinking of crossing the marshes? Yes. Hmm, it'll probably be safer for you to get a chocobo. That way you can zip through the marshes with the chocobo. It's the only way to avoid being attacked by the Midgar Zolum. Midgar Zola. It's a serpent-like creature over 30 feet tall. It detects the footsteps of anyone in the marshes. And then, BAM! It attacks! To avoid that, buy a chocobo at me and Chocobilly's Chocobo Farm. To purchase a chocobo, please talk to my grandson. He's in the chocobo stables the far right end of the farm. Looking for an inn? Actually, yes. How about a hundred gill a night? Yeah. Thank you for your patronage. That mic really picks up the cracking of my knuckles. <gasps> I'm old and brittle. Hey, kiddo. You're Choco Billy, right? I don't remember. Do you want a Chocobo? Give me a Chocobo! You old folks are out of luck. Old folks? We're all out of Chocobos. I'm taking care of the of the ones out there for someone else. You know, if you really want a chocobo, you should go out and catch one. Want to know how to catch a chocobo? How? A wild chocobo always appears with other monsters, but you won't be able to catch it because of the monsters. That's why you must defeat the monsters first before you catch the chocobo. And then? Wild chocobos are really cautious. They'll run away from, from the smallest things, but if you use greens, they'll focus on them and won't run away. Well then, shall we get down to business? I'll sell you the Chocobo Lair for 2,000 gil, right now. You want it? Thanks. Hey, you don't have enough. Fuck. And I'm gonna have to purchase greens as well. God damn it. God damn it. Wasn't it really expensive? But don't be mad at my brother or grandpa. Ever since mom and dad died, it's been like this. Great. More grinding. I'm gonna need like, let's say like 3,000 gil. That sounds like enough. I'll have to purchase some Gishal greens as well. There's a bunch of birds! Oh god, the birds! Uh. 
and show off the first summon of the game, Chocomog. Death blow! Got him, just like that. Yay, Eris leveled up. Oh, this won't take long. Everything here gives an adequate amount of money. Ooh. Oh, look at that does that mountain. As I turn the camera. Ooh. Ooh, that bit mapping. Just like waves. Oh. Oh, 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 that's so ugly. Okay. <laughs> look away from it. Oh, it does it no matter where I'm looking. Oh. Don't focus on the distance. Oh my god, stop back attacking us. Okay. <laughs> Just cure us all. Here's drop another summon on them to kill them. We don't have to think about it. Ow! Almost there, almost there. We technically don't need Gishal Greens, but I'm gonna get some anyways. You know what, I'll just get to 2,000 and then we'll do one more battle and hopefully that'll be enough. Oops, I did not mean to run in here. At least they chose a very appropriate place for their Chocobo farm, because there are like Chocobo tracks all over the place here. Levricon? Sewer? Ah, screw you. Oh, yeah! Ow. Just save. Yeah, save the MP. <laughs> Just smack them to death. Almost there. Almost there. Get some weeds! I don't trust them! Mandragoras. Let's crush them! <laughs> wow, they did nothing! Oh, well, that one's dead. Seems a bit excessive, but yeah, sure. <laughs> Cross slash! Oh, that one stopped. We still couldn't manage to rob it. Right, well, we got some money. Let's go. Let's go buy the things we need to buy. Excuse you. 
Choco Belé. Choco Belé. Come here. I will buy it. Thanks. It won't hurt to get by some greens either. Oh, and how fast does Choco Belé finish eating? Depends on what type of greens you feed them. Mmm, I got cracker greens. One cracker green, thank you. Okay, so we need to replace this sense command with Choco Butler. <laughs> Gives you luck. Love me some luck. Okay, so now all we have to do is run on these tracks. And eventually a Chocobo will appear. And by eventually, I meant immediately. With no hesitation. Oh god, they're in the back row. Okay. Where are these? Is it running away already? Okay, well, never mind. Never mind! I guess the first thing I should do is give it some greens. No waiting! We need a little, little bit of healing. Yeah, I like that. Just like that. Okay, this time we will immediately give it a crack of root. God damn it! It ran away. He's still gonna use the cracker root. Just, just healed the enemy. Great. So I need to go buy more cracker roots now, and then remember to put them at like the very top. Give me your stuff, bird. <sighs> I want to know how close that one all material is to leveling up. One ninety, pretty close. Pretty close. Okay, more cracker root. Although, let's go to the inn first. Get a little, get a little nap nap. Get some sleep. Yo, Choco Belly. Oh, there are Gishal Greens at the very bottom. Get those then. Screw Cracker. Boost. By name? By type? Battle. Yeah, okay. And then custom. We will move potion. We need to use that guard source. Where is some Gishal greens? Oh, when you want a chocobo, can't go wrong with some Gishal greens. <coughs> oh, <coughs> oh, 
wasn't fast enough that time. Damn. Okay, let's... Just in case, save the game. Okay, I know. Grasslands area. <coughs> whip, whip. It's an elephant thing. Attack the alpha dunk. One down. Yes, kill the alpha dunk, please. Stay, Chocobo, stay! Shit! Okay, I was like, no, he's gonna attack it! How to ride a Chocobo. Press cancel to get off. Chocobos will escape whenever a player dismounts. Can like run right over the Midgar Zolem. <laughs> you cannot. I was wrong. It will chase you down. Hey, can we uh, run? No, we're gonna die. Oh my god, it didn't kill us! It's got nothing to steal. Well, we're fighting this then! <laughs> Oh my god, you can poison it? I didn't know you could actually poison it. Oh, cloud. Well, apparently it's weak to bio, so... Oh, you're dead. <laughs> JK! Wake up, Barrett! Get up, buddy! Uh... It is not having a good time. Neither are we. Oh, thank God. Kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it! <laughs> I was joking around and ended up in a fight with the Midgar Solemn. Okay, we're just gonna keep up the cures, it's fine. How much health does this thing have? Oh! Sure. Level 26. Oh, it's, it's almost dead. Beta. That's a... Painful. But that's a blue... It killed us both. Learned enemy skill beta. Died. Oh. 
Oh, it. Oh, God damn it! I didn't mean to get off. It's because Eris got knocked away. So we learned beta. <laughs> oh my God. We got away with learning beta. I thought. It said we did. It's not showing up, though. God damn. We did not. Ah, oh, curses! Actually, can we, like, make it back? Help! Oh, my friends are dead! Right, so this is where we learn beta. Good to know. Be back here later date. We almost actually killed it. If I grinded out like two levels on everybody, I'm pretty sure we could kill that thing. I don't want to do that, but I could. Anyways. Anyways, before I accidentally pressed cancel. God damn it. Just a normal enemy. Who has back attacked us? You all are about to die. Presumably. Death Blow seems to do a very random amount of damage. That was enough. I should have tried Chocomog on it, because it might have stopped it. I didn't think of it because of the sheer panic at the time of, Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Come on, just kill them, Eris. Let's get our chocobo back. Cause I accidentally pressed cancel and dismounted. Come on, one more try. And we'll go buy some more Gishal Greens. Yay! JK, we don't need to do that. Bio is surprisingly powerful. I should not have attacked that one. Oh, thank god. I thought I was going to attack the Chocobo. <laughs> Healing Wind. I don't know what she's doing with the Staff Rack Theater, but as a child, I always thought she was just like, Holding it like kind of up, just like waving it back and forth like a fan. I was like, what are you doing? This is not what you do with staves. Staves. Stay, Mr. Chocobo. Okay, good. Stay. Don't leave me. Right, so avoid the snake, avoid the snake, avoid the snake! Oh god, oh god! The 
And yep, there's a dead Midgar Zolem. Did Sephiroth do this? Our enemy is someone that could do this? This Sephiroth guy's pretty strong, I'd say. I mean, I guess we're scared, but after just fighting one, not only did we survive, we very nearly killed it. So... Not all that impressive. Calm down, guys. Okay, off the chocobo. And let's take back... Well... Do I need another sense? No. I guess we can leave on the Choco Lure. Gives you luck. That's nice. That's nice! Alright. All right. This one! Yeah, okay. Let's go in. To these caves. I immediately get attacked! By men with balls! <clears throat> Madouge. <coughs> oh god, I'm choking. I just... I love Eris' attack animation. She uses this, like, karate jump across the screen to smack them with her staff. Like, she doesn't run up like everybody else. She just, she just goes flying. Oh my god, everyone's blind! Gotcha! Go right. See what's that way. An item. An ether. A tent. Good. We'll probably make use of that when we get out of this cave. Holy shit! That's a lot of enemies. You learn that too? No. You learn fire breath, but cold breath. Nope. Don't know what that is. Well. Arc dragon. Is dead. We got a high potion for it. Hell yeah. We can climb up this, can't we? Yes, we can. Though I don't know if this is the way we're supposed to go. Nope. This is how you get long range. Oh, what does long range do? Same attack power, even from the back row. I'm gonna put Barrett back in the back row. Take off his chocobo lure. Well, that was the correct way to go, because it was the wrong way to go. So let's keep up the good look good work. A mine source. We'll use that eventually. No doubt. Ah snakes. Ice breathing snakes. Yeah, we're gonna murder all of these guys with a chocobo. Just 
Stop cold breathing me! Death blow! Guessing that does less damage than... Oh, well, no, it doesn't matter. It does do less damage, but it's still more than enough. More than adequate. And another high potion. Okay. <laughs> Don't know what the point of that was. Ah, fuck! <laughs> Just a second! Who are you? Do you know who I am? The Turks, right? Well, if you know, then this won't take long. It's difficult to explain what the Turks do. Kidnapping, right? To put it negatively, you could say that. But that's not all there is to it anymore. Sir! It's alright, Rude. I know you don't like speeches, so don't force it. Then explain, Elena. I'm the newest member of the Turks. Elena, thanks to what you did to Reno, we're short-handed. But because of that, I got promoted to the Turks. Anyhow, our job is to find out where Sephiroth is headed, and to try and stop you every step of the way. Wait a minute. It's the other way around. You're the ones that are getting in our, our way. Elena, you talk too much. Mr. Sang? No need to tell them about our orders. Sorry, Sang. I thought I gave you your orders. Now go. Don't forget to file your report. Oh, right. Very well. Rude and I will be af go after Sephiroth, who's heading for Junon Harbor. Elena! You don't seem to understand. Oh! I am sorry. Go. Don't let Sephiroth get away. Yes, sir! Reno said he wanted to see you after the injuries you gave him healed. He wants to show you his affection for you all, with a new weapon. Well then. Eris, long time no see. Looks like you're safe from the Shinra for a while, now that Sephiroth reappeared. What are you saying? That I should be grateful to Sephiroth? No. I won't be seeing much of you, so take care. Strange, hearing that from you. Well then, stay out of Shinra's way. Weird. Give me that elixir. And a high potion. Mount Condor. Oh, God. Okay, well... I think I'll be ending the stream about here because Mount Condor is probably going to be its own stream. Because holy shit. So yeah. I hope you enjoyed watching. I'm going to go get some food because I haven't eaten today and it's nearly 9pm where I am. So. Yay. Uh, oh god. I'll be streaming tomorrow. Again. Because I do shorter streams just every day. So if you miss one, you don't miss that much. So, uh, yeah. Look forward to that. Obviously, all this stuff's going on the YouTube for you to watch later if you miss it and want to come back and see it again for whatever reason. So, yeah. Look forward to that. See you later. Have a nice night. Have fun with your D&D games and your Final Fantasies and your, your RPGs. All that stuff. I will see you later. Uh, bye bye <laughs>